assalamu alaikum beautiful people as you know in building construction works we keep the wall thickness normally 9 inch but in some cases we are using 4.5 inch wall thickness means half brick so what's the reason behind this where we can use 4.5 inch wall thickness this is the topic for today means best idea of 4.5 inch wall so let's start guys as you know when we, when we are using okay our 4.5 inch wall reduce the construction cost it reduced the cost of construction 4.5 inch wall so if you want to use 4.5 inch wall in building construction so which one wall should be 4.5 inch guys as you can see guys this is the house plan this is the plan right so as you can see guys the exterior wall walls are exterior wall okay so here the exterior walls are nine inches okay so anywhere the exterior wall of the house should be nine inch but as you can see guys this wall is 4.5 inch this one 4.5 inch also this one is 4.5 inch right and some also other cases for example this one right this is also 4.5 inch remember guys the partition walls should be 4.5 inch if you want to reduce the cost of construction but the exterior wall should not be 4.5 inch as you can see guys here uh, this is the partition wall so this is 4.5 inch but this the front wall in which we are fixing the door and windows okay so the front wall should be nine inches means where we fixing door and windows frames as you can see guys here we are using door and windows so therefore the thickness of the wall should be nine inches in this case but in partition wall if you want to reduce the cost of construction then you can use 4.5 inch wall because here we need for example if this wall uh, okay for uh, for example if we required for this wall for example if we required 1000 bricks for this one okay so in the case of 4.5 inch wall we required 500 bricks for example this is just example because 4.5 inch wall thickness is half of brick but the exterior wall is should be nine inches so in this case but one thing other guys especially in washrooms or in bathroom where you are fixing the sanitary work so there we should also not use 4.5 inch wall that's why because there we are fixing the sanitary for tap for uh, shower etc we are fixing the pipes for sanitary works so therefore if we have the 4.5 inch wall so there we are cutting the wall for fixing the pipes pvc pipes so in that case it cannot it cannot give you a support it cannot afford the pipes so the sanitary wall should be must nine inches but try to use half brick means 4.5 uh, inch wall and the partitions as you can see guys this is partition this is front so this front is nine inches this is front this is also nine inches this is exterior wall this is nine inches but here guys you can see this is partition wall so it should be if i'm making the front of this so it should be also nine inches 
as you can see guys this is 9 inch this is 9 this is 4.5 this is 4.5 and this is 4.5 okay for example if you have here as you can see this is for example uh, bath okay so here you can make all walls 4.5 inch but except for example if we are using the symmetry here in this wall okay so it should not be 4.5 inch if in the case of symmetry work we are fixing the pipes pvc pipes for what in the case of symmetry works so it should be what four uh, nine nine inches full nine inches it should be so this is the important topic which i have discussed the front of you best idea of 4.5 inch wall it can reduce the construction cost of the project okay but the exterior walls and front walls are where you want to fixing the pipes for sanitary work so it should be 9 inches but the partition wall should be 4.5 inches to reduce the construction cost it can help you more so guys this is the important topic which i have discussed the front of you thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye